Hello viewers. Hope everyone is doing great. In this video, let us learn how to prepare the black forest cake. First, let us see what are the ingredients needed for preparing the cake batter. Please add one and a half cup of all-purpose flour, one cup of powdered sugar, half a cup of cocoa powder, one teaspoon of baking soda, quarter teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon of vanilla essence. Now let us look into the wet ingredients needed. Now take one cup that is 250 ml of milk. To this add one tablespoon of white vinegar to curdle it. If you have buttermilk add one cup of it. This curdled milk or the buttermilk will give the cake a fluffier and spongy texture. Once the milk is curdled, it is ready to be added. Now add half a cup of melted butter. Now let us see the ingredients needed for preparing the cherry syrup. Add one cup of fresh cherry fruits. To prepare the sugar syrup, take quarter cup of water and take two to three tablespoon of sugar crystals. Now let us see the ingredients needed for preparing the whipped cream. Take 2 cups of liquid cream or heavy cream. Also take 2 to 3 tablespoons of powdered sugar. And finally let us see the ingredients needed for the decoration. Take a generous amount of chocolate shaving, glazed cherries from the sugar syrup and the prepared whipped cream. Now let us get into the cake layer preparation. For preparing the cake batter, first seam the dry ingredients namely the flour, the cocoa powder, sugar, baking soda and salt respectively. Seam the dry ingredients separately and together again. Next, add the vanilla essence and melted butter into the curdled milk. Then slowly whisk in the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients with a hand whisk. If the batter seems too thick, add a little water to thin it. The batter will finally look like this. Now, Pour the batter into a butter lined pan and tap the pan to level the batter and to remove any air bubbles. This makes the cake flat because we do not want a dome shaped top. Preheat the oven to 350 Fahrenheit or 180 Celsius. It is always good to preheat the oven when we start to prepare the batter. Now bake the cake at 180 celsius for the first 10 minutes and then bake again at 170 celsius for 8 minutes. Insert a toothpick to check if the cake is done. Else bake for few more minutes in 170 degrees celsius. Now we are done with one cake layer. We need two such layers to make a complete black forest cake. Now let's prepare the cherry syrup. First, heat the water in a vessel on a stout top and bring it to a boil. Add in the sugar crystals and cherries and keep stirring this mixture. Bring it to a simmer and leave it for a while until the syrup consistency is reached. Then turn off the flame and leave the syrup to cool down. Now strain the syrup to remove the cherries. Reserve the cherries for assembling in between the layers of the cake and for the top layers decoration. Now let us prepare the whipped cream. Before preparing the cream, place the bowl and the whisk attachments in the freezer and chill for about 30 minutes. 
Place the whipped cream in the refrigerator and take it out just two to three minutes before you start the whipped cream preparation. For preparing the whipped cream, take the bowl and the whisk attachments out from the freezer and the liquid cream. Set the whisk to medium speed and start whisking. Once soft peaks starts to appear, add in the sugar. Whisk until stiff peaks appear. Do not over whisk. It may result in the formation of the butter. Now let us start assembling the cake. First, cut the chocolate cake layers into horizontal halves. Since we prepared two batches of chocolate cakes and cut into horizontal halves, we have got four cake layers in the process. Place one layer, preferably the most dense cake layer, on the bottom. Drench the layer with cherry syrup and spread a generous amount of whipped cream over it. Place the cut cherries on top of the whipped cream and place the next layer on the top of it. Repeat the same process for the next two layers. When you place the final layer, drench it with cherry syrup and spread the generous amount of whipped cream over it and on the sides of the cake. Now comes the decoration. Cover the whole of the cake which is covered already with the cream with the chocolate shavings. Dust some cocoa powder over it. Pipe 5 to 6 rosettes with the whipped cream and on top of them place the whole cherries we had kept aside earlier. Now place the cake into the refrigerator overnight or at least for 2 hours minimum. Tada! The cake is ready! So chilled and enjoy! Hope you enjoyed the video. See you all in the next video. Take care till then. Bye bye. Have a nice day.